Hi there, great you're watching. Welcome to the Tom Drivers Tournament, my own tournament, and this time the registration of September. And I will play 10 boards, MP scoring. <clears throat> and if you beat me or did beat me, you will get uh, diamonds as a reward. So I will just play the boards and we'll be thinking out loud and see it, see what the boards bring us. So my partner opens one spade. I've got a 4441 four, four, with only one spade. 4441 four, four, is general, in general a bit an overrated hand uh, because you don't have any five cards. And especially now my partner bids in my singleton. So do I want this to be game four as well? I'm really too strong for one no trump. So I will have to bid two clubs. Asking Byron to describe his hand. Two spades, at least two spa uh, five spades. Can also, uh, don't have to be six spades. So two no trump and three now it is. So let's see if I was right and that's the... 4441 is an overrated one. Or can I make this happen? My partner has a nice hand, 14 points, 14 counts. So first I will be counting my tricks. Well, with a bit of friendly spades, there will be five spade tricks, three hard tricks is eight. And for the rest, none. So I will try to develop the clubs. I can also finance the diamond. But the clubs seem to be the seems to be the safest choice. I'm also thinking a bit because when I would uh, uh, first cash my spade tricks there is some danger because I will have to uh, discard lots of cards and when I first play my spades and discard my diamonds I won't be able to develop the clubs because I will have to lose the diamonds so I'm thinking a bit what is wise well, I will keep the ace of hearts thing on the table as a to cross the dummy Well, it's really no easy board to start with. I'm still thinking of the best line of play. So my first thoughts are small hearts to the king, then the king of spades, small hearts to the ace, and then cashing my spades. But I will have to lose four cards. I can discard one heart, one diamond, well, two diamonds, okay, and one club. But then I can only develop one more club trick. Well, let's play a small heart. Then for the well, let's let's not make wiser. Well, I'm still going to play the King of Spades. And let's play a call up and see what happens. So the ace of clubs. Okay, diamond switch. No, let's see. This is what I want to see, of course. OK, 
Okay, I can play small diamonds for my king. <clears throat> But then I I have haven't got any communications, so let's do this a bit a funny way. So I'm playing the jack of diamonds and taking the king. So we keeping my entry to the ten of diamonds. Yes, now see how the spades are running. Seven. Ah, spades unfriendly. So really interesting hand. Uh, four, seven, eight, nine, ten, yeah, two, two more spades left. Diamond discard, which is interesting because now the, my diamonds are good. Nine of space, now the ten of space is still in. So. Okay, so now it's all mine so really fun board to start with many possibilities but of course the ace queen of uh, diamonds made life much easier for me the spades were behaving really badly but of course because of the hard lead hearts which you see on the leading the jack to the 10 and my, I had four hard tricks and, and didn't realize that. So, uh, nice hundreds, only one. So, of course, I was a bit lucky <clears throat> because Arshin did return the ace and queen of diamonds. But let's play the next one. Maybe this is easier and goes faster, but you never know. Okay, 16 counts. I can do two things. I can either open one diamond or one no trump. Uh, going by the book, you would uh, be opening one diamond and uh, rebinning three diamonds. But well, in, well, most in practice, it's better to just open one no trump because the bidding is easier. Okay, I have to check what uh, the biddings uh, mean. So two majors, two clubs is majors, two hearts, partner has a stopper and hearts. Now when partner has a stopper and hearts, uh, and I've got a small stopper in spades, let's play a three no trump. Okay. Quite a minimum, eight points. But you see here, I've got six diamond tricks. And when West has the king of hearts, it's all okay. So I will first check that. This is, of course, bad news for me. Returning a spade, of course. So let's think a bit. Uh, six diamond tricks. Two hard tricks is eight, and one club is nine. Putting the king in king of spades, of course, would be wrong when West could play ace, queen, jack of spades. That's so good. So I'm expecting West to have uh, the spades. Important to catch the hard trick. And then just collecting my tricks. 
diamond tricks and the ace of clubs. Trying crazy things for over tricks. Okay, so three no trumps just made. Quite a normal result, I think, but scores heavily. So I think. What's important is to open one or trump with this hand. Then you will get a decent score. <clears throat> okay, opening one heart. You see, uh, I've got all the good suits. I can double, like I've got an opening and uh, also Tarke, but with my five card spades, I really like to bid one spade. And an overcall of one spade can be up to 16 or 17 points. What do we do now? Four hearts, so basically I can't do anything. Doubling would be possible, but really tricky. So the only sensible thing to do here is to just pass. And I've got no good lead. I don't want to play from ace-queen and underleading the king with partner having maybe no points. Four hearts can be a bit weaker, maybe, but still, I will put in a neutral lead by the eight of hearts, not giving away positions. Okay, spade. Okay, this can be tricky when East hasn't got anything. East can have king, jack of spades, so. Safety first, queen of spades, and then a small spade. And still safety first, <clears throat> not playing uh, the clubs. I will let my partner play the clubs or diamonds, doesn't matter. Well, I should have doubled, I see, because it goes down one. But okay. Good score, maybe because of the lead. So going to the fourth board, partner opening two hearts, showing a weak hand with hearts. Um, no, it's a Dutch opening bid with five hearts and the four or more in a minor. That makes a difference because partner only has five hearts. What do I have to bid now? I've got a really good hand, 16 points. When partner has hearts and clubs, three no trumps could be a great bid. So I will ask my partner partner please indicate your range and your suit so partner has hearts and clubs and a minimum uh, still i will i will bid three no it's a bit a bit tricky maybe but uh, what do i want to do three spades i have no clue okay so three clubs what did three clubs show Five to eleven points. Okay, I thought it would be a minimum, but okay, looks okay. <clears throat> Depending how the spades the spades will break, I've got two options: spades and hearts, and I will try both. So small diamond. Okay. And let's play the spades. Let's see how the spades. Uh... Break three and five. This is no good news. 
because I'm missing the two and normally Arshin will do honest carding. So I think that the space will be four, two. So I'm thinking a bit what to do. Well, what are my options? What are my options like this one? Queen, so thought would be the case. So I think that two of space will be an east, yeah. So spades are divided four two. I can, I've got more options. I can play a spade or I can play diamond, diamond and the hearts. But why not play a spade? Well, when I go play a spade, I will lose two spade tricks and two club tricks. Four, and now I've got three tricks, but three hearts, six, seven, eight. Uh, I could make all the, I could make 10 with the hearts, three, three. So what should I do? No, I'm miscounting because of course uh, I'm counting the, the diamond trick, but uh, nobody has seen the, the king of diamonds. So sorry, three plus five hearts is eight and only the diamond ace is 10, ace is nine. I have to learn to count. Nine tricks, so if I play spade, spade, there will be a problem because when I play the 10 of spades, I can discard a club, of course. And when East makes the error of playing another spade, I'm happy. What happened? So let's play a heart. Let's see how the hearts are divided. Doesn't look good, six and nine. Okay. The uh, hearts are friendly. Mm, let's play a club. And now think. Do I want? Well, do I want an overtrack? Of course, I want an overtrack, but. Do, is it okay to take a risk? Let's say I play a club to the queen and they take three club tricks and the jack of space. I'm still okay. So I'm taking the, this line, just hoping uh, um, let's say Okay. Yeah, this is a problem. No, it's not no problem. Oh, I'm sorry. So I'm now taking the other the other trick. So I'm thinking a bit now taking the, the spade trick, but which is of course okay, but freaky deal. So let's head for the next one. I've had easier tournaments, but it's not like 
I've got only the suits of the opponent, so I will be quiet and pause. It's not my style, but I have to do now. Two clubs, okay. This is uh, funny. This is a natural bit, so there's for well, there's a more remark I want to place here because when you beat north, normally you would lead a club. This is a typical bidding where you want to lead. So that doesn't happen. Two clubs. Pardon me, the ace of hearts probably has got also the king of hearts. See if we can get some tricks. Now the club, but was now the the unfortunate thing is I can't return a club. So play a diamond. Uh, doesn't really matter now. Part rough, okay. Spade for the bad guys, for the seven of clubs. Of course, I can discard my spades. Discarding the six of diamonds. And partner makes the four of clubs. So the contract will be down one. Another great result, so... I'm really going really good. Let's see if I also can score a bit less because, of course, it would be nice to also give away some dime. Well, not give away dimes. You have to earn them, of course, but normally I'm not scoring this heavily. We now trumps. Nothing special in the bidding. Let's see if play has got nice elements. So uh, I will count my tricks. So one spade trick, two hard tricks is three. Three club tricks is six. And you see in the diamonds, you can develop three tricks and diamonds. And maybe I will get more. But that will be bonus. So, okay. Let's just play a small heart. Maybe on the least king, well, queen jack. Doesn't happen. So I will play the ace of hearts. And... Try to develop the diamond, so diamond for the ace. We'll return a heart. I don't expect to, uh, uh, East to have uh, the jack, so I will play a small one for the eight. Okay, cashing the jack of diamonds first, which is not hard to see, but important. And then cross to my hand to play the king queen of diamonds. I don't expect the clubs to be 3-3, three, three, but still trying. But of course, I'm also hoping uh, to get some throw in. So I will play a club. Let's think. Yeah, I think I have to play a club to the king if it doesn't work. I will play spade, spade. Well, discarding the nine of hearts, which is smart. Uh, because I want to try my option to throw in with spades. Well, work, but discarded the heart. So uh, good defense. Scoring average and uh, going to the next deal, deal seven. 
partner opens one spade. Well, maybe slam option, 16 points, good hands. First, I will just bid one, two hearts, just examining partner, what have you got? Two spades. Well, this is game force. So just promising three spades and letting partner, uh, giving partner the option to bid Q. So four clubs, club Q. And I've got no diamond queue. So I will have to bid four hearts to show. Basically, the most important thing to show is, partner, I don't have a queue in diamonds. Well, partner bids four no, showing a queue in diamonds. I've got two key cards, the ace of spades and the ace of clubs. So five hearts it will be. Six spades, so it's a uh, MP scoring. So you could try your luck, you're just bidding uh, six no. But of course there is the option of partner having just one club. Well, is the option there with partner bidding two spades? Ooh. Well, it is, it is possible. So six no Trump would be gambling. And I'm not doing that. So six spades, it is. Well, is this working? I've got uh, cut my losers. I've got two diamond losers, one spade loser. But my diamond loses, I can discard on the hearts. So I will just be financing the spade. And I'm hoping it's offside. It's wrong sided because uh, now I'm really making everything. And now you will be also making everything playing in a no Trump contract. So I won't be complaining. Well, I am a bit, of course. But with the spades, so good. Most people who will be gambling to seven or bidding six, no Trump will be good. So this, I presume, a percentage of something between 30 and 40. Well, it's not. Rich is good for me today. So scoring decent and going to board eight. Partner opens one diamond, one heart, two diamond. Well, nothing extras, but I want to show my five card and heart. So I'm not sure how Arjun does this. Normally I will bid two now Trump as game forcing bids, but I think with Arjun it's natural. So... Hmm. I have to bid two spades here. Three hearts, okay. Exactly three hearts. So I will bid four hearts. Okay, jack of clubs lead. Let's see. I'm missing two club tricks, one heart, two spades. Of course, I can discard lots on the diamonds. Uh, with the jack of club leads, I can also play another club and discard a spade. But won't be necessary because... I will be playing on diamonds. And there's not a risk. Normally you would say it's, there's a risk of uh, don't roughing the club because when you play hard, 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 they will take two club tricks. But here is not the case because I've got the nine and the eight. So not really a, uh, not really a risk. That's why I can play safe. 
Okay, but now when I would now play diamond, diamond, diamonds, uh, I can discard uh, a club. I could play another diamond to discard, but I've got no entry. Well, of course, I've got an entry because when they rough, of course, I can play a heart to the nine. So nothing really at stake. Just playing diamonds. Ah, takes takes and then still can collect the club trick so okay now the rest is i can claim the rest for 11 tricks quite an easy board and an average score so two more boards to go nine and ten 11 count i will pass pass again and again and defending. So defending two diamonds. Opponents don't play X, Y, Z. Then two diamonds will be game force. Yeah, first I want to see what's in dummy. So let's play the ace of diamonds. Ten of partner. And I don't hope it's got check ten. And this just did cost a trick. Okay. Two diamonds. Partner will have some points. So 14 points in west, six to nine in east, let's say six, 20. Then partner has nine. My partner can have like something like six to nine points. There's a danger in clubs. This cards, but well, the hearts and the spades, I don't want to attack them myself. So I will play like very neutral a club. This changes things a bit. Will East do this with Ace Jack of Hearts? The partner has five, so it doesn't. Suppose partner has. Two hearts. No, it doesn't matter. So I can return a heart, I think. For the ace, okay. Okay, so now I'm discarding the spades. Fine by me. Yeah, well, I'm not really fine. Just did cast a trick. So last board. Last board of this session. 10 points. Well, wow, good 10 points with five hearts, four spades, but still. I will count to 20. So the longest suits are five hearts, four spades, nine and nine. 10 points, sorry, is 19. 19 is no 20. So pass. One old trump. So now I can bid two clubs for majors, I hope. Landy. So I've got two majors whose two diamonds is like partner. What's what do you prefer? Well, I prefer hearts. Three hearts. But partner, we both don't have an opening bid, so I'm too scared. This is also why I think like three hearts is an overbid because we both don't have an opening bid. So uh, it's a shame because here you see I've got uh, three club losers. 
one diamond loser and two spade losers. So this will be down. The partner really should have passed two hearts. Here you see the problem coming. Club, 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 and the ace of spades. Yeah, they are just collecting their winners. So I'm first taking this in hands and then crossing to dummy, collecting the diamonds, but okay. I will be claiming down one, which is a pity. It shouldn't be necessary. So I got it in second. So really good score of 72%. So thanks a lot for joining me this tournament. I hope for you all I will score a bit less next time. Uh, so you can win uh, more diamonds. And uh, I hope you enjoyed this video. You can always apply the comments with tips for me maybe. Or maybe just if you like it. And I will see you next time on the Tom Drivers Tournament. Next month, we will be back. Bye-bye and enjoy the boards.